Okay, well, in lieu of any audio, I'll just talk a little bit over this. So there should be some music which beautifully frames some of the work, but um, a few teething problems, um, I think. Um, so this is a bit of an uh, insight into some of our processes and a little bit of the intro to our work. Um, and um, uh, this really frames some of the work that we've been doing. But there we go, the audio is back. Great. So this is Leia. Leia is my uh, studio. We are 20 designers in East London. Um, we do lots of types of work. So we do the kind of design Shanghai luxury furniture pieces that Herman Miller and uh, uh, Prince Hansen and people like this. And then we do the tech things for people like Samsung and Google and those kind of guys. And then lots of things in between. So this will really represent some of that work. So the first project I'd like to talk to you about is really where the studio has come from when it was under Benjamin Hubert um, and is a kind of a linchpin to where we're going as well. So we're going to start with some furniture. Um, this is a project uh, we did for Fritz Hansen. So Fritz Hansen, for anyone who doesn't know, mid-century um, big guys in Denmark. And this was a project that we worked on for three years. Um, and often that is the case in furniture, that you work and prototype and test and build and rebuild and prototype and talk and talk and talk with the people that you're working with. Um, and it often takes all of these steps to get the whole company on board so that you can deliver piece of furniture, particularly for some of the bigger companies. So um, this was really a process where, you know, they're a, a very established furniture brand. You have a, a, a DNA, a language which inherently is um, ingrained in who they are. So you have to work with their team on understanding um, the, the, all the points to push and pull within the business so you can bring everybody with you. So this was really about thinking about what the materials they use, the DNA, the language, the visual language, and then starting to talk to them about values that were newer to the business. So not just a beautiful piece of furniture, but something that was a little bit more intelligent. I started to talk to them about a system. So the idea of a modular system that you can figure and people can tailor their own needs and wants and desires around piece of furniture. So put very simply, it's a plywood seat with an injection molded polycarbonate back and you can kind of interchange the back, backrest, the seat, the legs to build a system of around 8,000 different uh, models. So when an architect or interior designer comes in to use a piece of furniture, they can specify the things that they need most. Um, and quite a simple story to start with, but you know, even with that simple story, this was a three-year project that took time for that idea and the, and the intelligence to kind of resonate with the business that traditionally craft very, very beautiful piece of furniture, but not always pieces of furniture that have a wider story. So just to kick us off, this is really a tale of working with a big furniture brand, introducing some intelligence to that story while embracing who they were.